What's up, Skrulgers? It's Nerp here, and today we're going to play a ranked match. My fellow guildmate Guido Fubini leapfrogged me from number one on the ladder, so at least that now gives me a reason to play ranked. I'm going to use the same aggro growth deck as I used in the last ranked match video. Here it is. And um, I'm only. F Guido, I think he is 1880, so um, hopefully I can get back to number one with a win today. And I'll be back when we find that match. Alright, found a match. It took a really long time, so hopefully the rating difference isn't too much that we won't gain enough rating if we win. Oh, Holofoil is pretty high rated. Good luck, have fun to him. And this is a pretty darn good starting hand, unless we get Ragged Wolf <laughs> on our better. I think he's playing growth, that's the thing. I think he's playing growth. I think he, if he ragdolls that better, oh god. He's gonna have a mulligan too to try to get it. Screw it, we're going for it. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten rid of that. I think I should have gotten rid of a Wetland Ranger. I don't care. Just no ragdoll, please. I don't think Holofoil is someone that hands me rating. Holofoil puts up good fights, and what is he doing? Let's just hope there's no Ragnarok, because I don't have a two-drop to follow up. If I had a Brave, this would be different. No! Yes! <laughs> oh, that was so stressful. Alright. You can't say his name? Oh, I think Guido... Uh, I have the profanity filter off so we can see it says Guido. I guess Guido is one of the things that are like blocked. Um, sometimes it's, I guess it could be used as like a derogatory term for someone. Um, against growth, I think the double on Ranger is a little better. And do I just move down and try to engage him here? I mean, he might go with a. What could he do? He could put a Brave down. That would suck. And I'm gonna move down. Okay. What? Why is Skype making noises when I always have it away? Okay. So what's he gonna do? Terrain for Wildling. All right, nice. We get a free kill on his Vetter. So far, so good. And a nice stain on Curve. I'm gonna be able to play the Vetter next turn. So I'll definitely kill this Vetter. Um, I should probably keep this open. Should I should probably protect that somehow? Cause I don't want to lose that to like a ragged wolf. Do I protect with the ranger or the tearing brute? Protect it, I'll protect it with the ranger. I'd rather have the tearing brute kind of like in the middle of things up there because with his massive four attack he kind of has to control a nice sec section of the board. And I do have a Kenfolk veteran for this turn but I don't really have anything to hit with it. I get, oh I could hit that. Oh, well, that's not a good thing to do, miscounting your own resources. So, yeah, I'm just going to get rid of the Fang Bear here and just take that thing out. And... I'm going to... I'm actually going to have the Terrian Brute in front. And now... Yep, always expect the Veteran. Always expect the Veteran. There's the Brave, and he doesn't have another creature to take that out, but that thing will be just dying soon. Let's sack first throws, hopefully get another Veteran, that would be really nice. Rumble, or Rally, I'm going to do one of these. I could Rally, take out the Wildling, or I can Rumble, and possibly take out both. Hmm, what do I want to do here? I'm just gonna rally. Yeah, sure. I'm just gonna rally and move up. I could have actually stayed there and took out that idol, but I'd rather almost take out middle idol. 
I mean, I guess it could have gotten, like, a bigger play with a rumble, but I could have rumbled and I could have backfired and then I wouldn't be able to kill anything. Okay, so he's going to be able to take out my Terrain Brute. So now, let's see. If I rumble, I'm probably going to be able to kill this Brave. Chances are I would be able to kill it. I mean, there's, oh, there's a chance I could have seized behind it. Hopefully I draw a Veteran. No Veteran. Do I just Great Wolf? Uh, or do I Rumble? I'm gonna Rumble. Ugh, really? <laughs> that kind of sucked. Um, Welp. What I'm gonna do is. Do a little bit of hiding, I guess. Well, he's top decking, so yeah, I'm not really that worried. He's top decking. Yes, yeah, so I'll just do that. Yeah, so I guess that didn't really go our way, but I can't be, I can't complain too much. Because uh, I, I have been having pretty decent, pretty great draws this match. It's always amazing to go better into 3 drop, into 4 drop, into 5 drop. And I can play a Great Wolf next turn. So worst case scenario this turn he has like a Ragged Wolf Crimson Ball. It wouldn't even do that much actually. He's just getting his forces going down there. Which means it's going to be hard for him to win. Because I might just take out Metal Idol here. I'll sacrifice Nog. Ragged Wolf. Uh, hmm. Should I just take out Metal Idol here? With what? Do I give up? I don't know. I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to take out Metal Idol right now. I'm going to give up the Vetter. Because I could still play both the Ragged Wolf and the Earth and Mirth the next turn by sacrificing for resources. So I'm going to give up the Vetter. I'm going to play the... I'm going to move you up and play the Great Wolf back here. So I could have taken out this idol as well, but I'd rather do it like this. Because now I have like my three biggest threats on this lane ready to pounce on anything that comes up to kill this better. Obviously the Great Wolf is not going to attack next turn. Alright, there's a rumble. And that was a pretty good rumble for him because he's able to kill this with no repercussions. Because I have nothing else I would really do anything so that was a very good rumble for him but it might not be enough to save him in this match we'll have to see so he moves his brave there i'm actually pretty close to winning okay at least he didn't have any play with the rumble so it'd be nice to get like a veteran or something uh, i actually want to keep the regular from the earthen red so i'm gonna sacrifice for scrolls I mean, actually, I could go Ragged Wolf or Earthen Mirth. I don't know, I'll sacrifice the Brute Rooster, I'll see what I get. Rally Mystic. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna play the Mystic. Down here, I guess there's not really any other choice I could have. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna play it here, actually. So I'm gonna... He can cut, move up if he wants. But... There's a Great Wolf right there. And... I don't think... He wants to touch a Great Wolf when I have a, uh, I have a Earthen Mirth and Ragged Wolf in my hand. So yeah, if he has another Rumble, I guess it could get a little bad if he has like a Rumble, Crimson Bull, but still, I have a lot of threats attacking next turn. So we should be fine. And... Dryadic Power, alright, so that guy's staying right there. And a champion ring. So at least that idol's gonna be taken down. And can I win this coming turn? Brave. Alright, now I can't. But I am, I am gonna be able to kill a lot of stuff though. Because I can just move down, move down, and then I'll go Ragged Wolf, Earth, and Mirth. Sure. And then I have a rally next turn. And now I could take out either the keeper or the veteran 
Honestly, the chance of him playing uh, three creatures uh, next turn to have attack equal to this veteran are not that high. But this guy would be a threat over the course of time because he has one countdown. But I'm actually going to take out the keeper because I do want to have this Ragdolf in the back. Because a rally next turn would make him attack. And five attack is enough to take out the Seidel. So we'll see. We'll see what happens now. Let's see, does he have like any attack buff or Ragged Wolf to kill this Ranger? Wildling back there. And that's it. So I think this is just going to be a rally turn. Not a win just quite yet, but after this turn is really going to be stuck. Well, if I could actually just Mangy Wolf. I mean, that wouldn't actually kill everything, so I'm just going to rally. And I'll move down too, so I'm really controlling more of the board here. Yeah, and that kind of seals, even though I didn't win that turn, that kind of seals his fate. Unless he has like a Quake or something, there's really not much he could do. I guess he's hoping he has like a double Ride Wolf this turn or something. Okay, well, there's that. And is that going to be game yet? Rally. No, actually it isn't. <laughs> if I had like a rally better, it would have been. Uh. So I'm going to actually keep the rally. I'm going to get rid of the Nog. He's actually a Mangy Wolf this turn. What am I saying? A rally is game. I could go like this. GG. So... Yeah, that game was pretty much in our favor most of the time. I mean, there were, were some scary spots, but it was pretty good. And probably got a chunk of rating from that. Yeah, these holofoils pretty decently rated. 1886, so that puts me back in number one. So that is good as always. And that'll be it for today, guys. So like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe for more content like this. And I'll see you next time. Keep on scrolling, scrollgers.